there are muscles between the ribs known as external intercostals. When the external intercostals contract, this expands the thoracic cavity and this allows us to inhale. When the external intercostals relax, uh, this causes the thoracic cavity to decrease its volume. This causes us to exhale. Mammals evolved a respiratory muscle which non-mammals lack. This is known as the diaphragm that separates the heart and lungs and the thoracic cavity from the abdominopelvic cavity. When the diaphragm contracts, it pushes down on the viscera, and this increases the volumes of the lungs. So when we inhale, uh, typically not only are the external intercostals contracting, but also the diaphragm is contracting. When we exhale, the external intercostals and diaphragm relax. Additional muscles can be used during forceful breathing. When we are forcefully inhaling, not only do the external intercostals and the diaphragm contract more than they normally would, but also neck muscles such as the scalenes and sternocleidomastoid pull on the rib cage from above. When we forcefully exhale, internal intercostals and the abdominal muscles contract. So additional muscles are used during uh, forceful inhalation and forceful exhalation.